Lights out, I'm your favorite Too many ways, been in your place There's delays Add it up, plus signs, zeros on the table Driving and vibing, bring the beat later Wanna make it bigger, just a little bit of flavor shine Good morning everyone, I hope you guys are doing well It is currently 5.45am in the morning And the reason why I'm up so early Is because we're going to be going to Melbourne And I'm really excited to take you guys with me. The reason why we're going to Melbourne is I, I'm actually going to be doing some stuff for Cartier. So for those of you who don't know, Cartier, luxury brand, um, and they reached out to me and they wanted me to wear some of their stuff and like take some photos for them, especially since I have some of their stuff already. It's really, really cool. So yeah, that's what's happening on Friday. Today, it's Thursday morning. So I just wanted to get to Melbourne because in Adelaide, we don't have a Cartier store. So I had to fly to Melbourne to do this, but yeah. Let's go to Melbourne. All right guys, we are here, and there's not many people at the airport, but um, there's people already looking at me. Maybe they think I'm a celebrity, because like I don't think anyone wears sunglasses to the airport. Oh yeah, anyways. <laughs> All right, no one asked, but to check. Hey guys, I hope you're all enjoying the vlog. I just want to take a quick moment to thank our sponsors for today's vlog and this vlog and making it all possible, which is Epidemic Sound. For those of you who don't know what Epidemic Sound is, it's the market leading platform for restriction free music. So what that means is, no copyright, which is awesome, right? If you're a creator or someone who wants to use music and don't want to get copyright flagged and want to get monetized from it, Epidemic Sound is like where you want to go. One of the things that I found particularly difficult, particularly as a creator, is when you're trying to find music that won't get copyrighted but fits the vibe of your vlog, right? Or, or the stuff that you're creating. And given that they have over 40,000 songs that you can choose from and 90,000 sound effects. Sound effects like this one that one and this one there's a song and sound effect that will suit you every need which is great the good thing about their library list it's dynamic and in the sense of they're always updating new tracks new songs and new sound effects so you always get the latest and greatest stuff to use for your content there's currently two kind of plans that they have there's a personal plan and the commercial plan the personal one is great for people like you and i right uh content creators uh, people just looking to not get their their stuff copyrighted Twitch streamers, people post on Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, the whole lot. And then you've got the commercial plan, which is more so for like businesses, freelancers who want to soundtrack their content. But yeah, guys, click that link in the description and let's get back to the vlog. Peace. All right, guys, we are in Melbourne now and guess who it is? What up? All right, guys, so we're at the gym now. So gym in the morning um, and hitting shoulders. Right? Yeah, dollars. And dollars. this will be a AP gym segment. Here we go. Yeah. I'm so weak. It's not good. It's not good. So, I interrupt today's gym session with a filthy commentary of Peter's filthy set. Oh. Yes. Look at the squeeze, bro. Crazy, bro. Nah, nah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Nothing. Try to get 10 reps. But I got nine, because I know I'm not a 10, that's why. Press done. Now we're doing that, like 
Huh? No. Uh, um, dumbbell lateral raises. Yep. Single arm. Single arm. Because I'm Because he's single. Because <laughs> we're single. <laughs> Stop. So, um, single arm lateral raises. Yeah. For all the single ladies out there. It's going to be funny where I'm going to start. I'll start my left arm first. <laughs> Um, now, rebuild. No, I really like how that feels. Anything cables? Anything with cables? Really nice. That's what she said. Alright, gym slash done. How was it? Uh, I think it was very productive. I think we've got a nice, solid squeeze. That's all you want from um, uh, a shoulder session. Um, but yeah, I think it was efficient. Uh, we didn't waste too much time. I think we got good contraction. Um, and yeah, you sell? Any thoughts? Okay. We'll, go, we'll, we'll go for a walk now. Yes. All right, so walking back to Aiden's place. Um, let me think, let me think. We actually haven't seen each other in a while. So, yeah. Aiden. Are you pulling any bitches? <laughs> Whoa, this guy. Why do you pull no bitches? <laughs> Let's keep walking. Um, Let's keep walking? Okay. Um, Notice how he has an answer. Um, um, I think you guys should watch the Whisper Challenge video to, to, to gather an answer for that, okay. that question. Let's just say things haven't really changed since then. Yeah, but, um, I see. I'm happy. I'm happy. Mm. happy. I think that's all that matters. Yeah, it's like you're happy. Right, yes, happiness. Yeah. Anyways, um, we're just walking back and then take a shower and then have some lunch. All right, we've made lunch. Now it's time for mukbang. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Time for a mukbang. So the topic for discussion today will be what food we're eating. So Aiden, do you want to go through the food um, that you're eating today? I can't really, um, I call it, um, um, a plethora of meats. A plethora is probably the wrong word, but just an, an assortment of meats and rice. You know, that's, that's sort of what I do. I source a bunch of meats and I put them together and I put it with rice. So I think you did today. Yeah. So I made egg, broccoli, well, microwaved, um, vegetables. Gum, which is rice, and then you gave me some of your pork belly, which is sick. Cool. Also, mm -hmm. after this mukbang, mm -hmm. um, you have to give the rating out of, out of 10. Of the food or the conversation? You can both. Or the experience. Or the experience. Yeah. Okay, let's do the experience out of 10. Mm -hmm. And then the food out okay. of 10. Okay. And obviously a 10 is equivalent to like sex. So is, is it better than sex? You're asking me? Yeah. Oh, okay. You, you'd think that I'd know, okay, cool. Um, okay, let's make the first discussion topic, Formula One. Cool, mm -hmm. so, other than Max Verstappen and Lewis Hamilton, who do you reckon is the third best driver on the grid? The third best? Yeah, because I'd say Max and Lewis are like equal. In terms of what I understand of driving, and sort of what I've seen so far, I think it's safe to say that Fernando Alonso is a pretty safe third, in my opinion, in terms of quality of drivers. As if you were to put these 20 drivers into 20 of the exact same cars, it could be a mix between top three, Max, Lewis, and Fernando. Yourself? No, I agree. Um, right behind Fernando there. So Fernando's the third? Yeah. Okay. So then I'd say my fourth is probably like Nicholas Latifi. Yeah, I, I agree with that one as well. I think Latifi or, or Mazepin as well. Mm, mm, mm. That's a really hard uh, decision. Okay, moving on from Formula 1. Let's talk about Rizology. In terms of uh, asking you about Rizology, right? No, asking each other. Asking you. Asking you, each right? Other. So, let's hypothetical situation that none of us are tied to. Let's say there's a person that you want to approach, right? <sighs> In the class? Oh, no, not even in clubs. In class. In class. What are your moves? 
I was gonna think of a, a cheesy pickup line, but like my game is so bad, I couldn't even think of a cheesy pickup line. So like, um, uh, uh, I wouldn't start with ten ums like I'm just doing now. Uh, but I'd be like, okay, let me help you. Okay, please. Role play. <laughs> we got Aiden. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm the girl that you like, okay? So I, I sit next to you in, in the class. That would never happen, by the way. Okay. I'm like, hey, Aiden, I just, I just really need help. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just, I just really need help. Oh, you do? Yeah, cool. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> With what the lecture is going through, I don't know, not understand it. Can you explain it to me? What's the lecture? <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. Uh, <clears throat> you need help? Uh, what, do you, what do you need help with? <clears throat> I just don't understand what the lecture's going through. Come on, man. Is this what you actually do? What? Sorry. Aiden. Sorry, my hands are sweaty. Sorry. I, oh, I, don't, I don't shake your hand. I don't want to touch you. I'm sorry. Um, shit. Um, 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 um. Bye. That's not a skip, by the way. That's, that is a real representation. What, what Aiden is showing you guys is... Lead them wanting more. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> what do you think this is, bro? Duh. Exactly, man. Like that. Do exactly what I just did, and you get all the people you want. It's that simple. Like, don't look them in the eyes because you know they don't want to see your face because you know you want to be mysterious. Yeah. Another hypothetical, and this is the lifestyle segment. So let's say <clears throat> you like this this girl. There's, there's interesting stuff. How do you interact differently to a girl that you like to a girl that you don't like? Oh, dude, it's so different. But like, it's like subconsciously different. Like, you don't want to be different, but you just are because like you just get nervous because you, you feel like you don't want to make mistakes. Versus like someone it doesn't have to be a girl or someone you don't even like. But like, like, like in that way. Yeah. So, Aiden talking to someone as a friend, and then Aiden talking to someone he wants something more with. Like, what? What can? What's oh. the big difference? Oh, I thought you wanted a role play. Oh, oh no, me. no role play. Um, <laughs> the difference would be within myself. Like, oh really? So like, you they wouldn't be able to know, right? Yeah. Or, it's yeah. like um, with someone that I want to like me, or like someone that I like. It's sort of like I'm anticipating every future like move or like word or sentence versus if I'm with someone who's just like who's just natural and like I'm not really like looking for anything. Yeah, 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 gotcha. Sure. You're just like way more in the present and it's just like, so much more easy to connect. I'm up to this segment of rating the food. Good man. Hold on. It's actually really good. It's all at 8.5. Like mm. the gum. You made the gum, right? Cook to cook. Yeah. Keep talking, sorry. That's a lot. Yeah. Um, mm. Girl was cooked to perfection. Mm -hmm. So kudos to you. Jung was pretty good. I made that. And then the pork belly. What, what is Jung? If people don't know what that is. Jung is a... Yeah, okay, cool. Nice. Um, and then the microwave vegetables weren't too bad as well. It's just a nice, like, Asian at home meal. It's like 8.5. So unfortunately, not better than sex, but M5 was really good though. It's good. Yeah, it's really good. I was satisfied. 8.5? Are you sure? Yeah. Why are you not satisfied? No, no. <laughs> Let me know some crazy fancy restaurant. Yeah, this is no, because I'm also taking into account the, I'm taking into account the quantity. Mmm. And the economy is a big one. Yeah, like nutritional yeah. value. Yeah. And the taste, obviously, and the satisfaction yeah. that, like, that's, yeah. Because would you say you eat a lot? Yeah. Same, I eat a lot as well. Like, most, like, most places when you eat out, like, just aren't it's enough. enough. It's just not enough. Gym segment. Oh, gym segment. Gym and health segment. You would say you're bulking or cutting at the moment. Cutting. Yeah. Cutting. Um, so you were in a bulk previously. Yeah. How was that experience? It wasn't as good as I. Had hoped because well, I was eating a lot, but mm. I'm not eating a lot of protein. Mm. Yeah, so it's I definitely gained a lot of muscle, yeah, and mass, yeah, and size. 
but I feel like it could be more productive and I feel like I let myself go a little bit towards the end. Like, mm -hmm. I'm heaps of tether away. So good though, but yeah, it's cool. So good, it's mm. cool. Um, and then just have to jump through. So then that leads on to how are you cutting? How am I cutting? Yeah, how were that last three weeks? How, how did, how was diet changed? So in that three cut weeks? out sugar drinks, like sugary drinks, just drank water and booze. Um, and then really cut down in terms of like, I didn't have a lot of white rice, I had brown rice. Mm -hmm. And then chicken breast, like lean meat with high protein. And then whenever I was feeling hungry, I just had a, I had a protein shake or like a banana and apple. Something that could sustain your, your hunger. Mm. Yeah. And then just did heaps of cardio. Such as? <laughs> Not sex. Um, just <laughs> 8.5. 8.5? I don't want to sound like a copycat, but that's 8.5. Like, I've had had better things, but that, just like a homey, nice, you know, rice and a sawing of meats, and just the comfortability of my own space, it makes. See, I get, I get some tiny experience into that, into that index as well, but I would say 8.5. Thank you for joining our mukbang. Um, you have uni? Now? Yes. Yeah. And then I have, I don't know yet. You guys will find out. Alright. Bye! No way. I don't want to sit down with me. He's done in his life. Bro, he chokes like the big down easy, bro. What are you, what are you rated out of 10? Out of 10. Out of 10. <laughs> Chloe, what do you rate it out of 10? What do you rate it out of 10? <laughs> Alright guys, that is the end of the day. Um, yeah, I'm super tired, but I'm super excited for tomorrow. Gonna get some sleep, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Cartier day. Hey guys, so it is the next day, and this morning I had to drop off Aiden at work, because we both Stayed up too late last night and um, yeah, played PlayStation. So we both woke up late. So basically I'm, I'm very late, yeah. But right now I'm going to be heading down to meet Jerry at his store and then we're going to walk to Cartier. So this is my fit. Just wearing straight black, showing a little bit of the ankles. I'm so sorry. I've got to bring socks, just kidding. But yeah, just literally got changed now on my way. I'm so nervous. I don't know what to expect, but the plan is um, get to go into the boutique. I'm not sure if I can actually record myself going into the boutique. I get to try on like these rings and these watches. There's, I think altogether they're worth around 60K, $62,000. But yeah, I'll get to try them on and then go around Melbourne and take photos. So really, really excited. So photo shoot is done. Um, Jerry and Viv helped take some photos for me. So yeah, hopefully they turned out really good. I think they did. I think it was like my first photo shoot. Yeah, it's super crazy that yeah, Cartier reached out. So yeah, I'm still kind of like shocked. But yeah, without Viv, she, her, her photos that she took were crazy. It was so good. So yeah, really happy with that. And then Jerry's just my guy. I think we're gonna go head back and eat. <laughs> All right, so we're having very, very late lunch now. The first one is corn cheese.
Um, so enough of Peter's cardiac shenanigans. Um, you're stopping me now. Uh, whether you like it or not, it's me. Uh, and we're here at this place tonight. Go Cardi. And look who it is. Yeah. He's here. I didn't, he didn't leave you guys. Trust me, he didn't leave you guys. Uh, I'm on a cute date with my date today. Um, you're looking real fine on this evening and uh, I'm gonna beat his ass. I'm gonna beat his ass and uh, you're gonna see it. So yeah, just once again, just an amazing experience and like super surreal. I'm still kind of in shock that Cartier reached out to me to do what I did. And hopefully I got like good enough photos to be honest. But yeah, massive shout out to Jerry and Viv for helping me. All my mother and friends that like came out to see me. Aiden, he was just a sick, sick guy. I beat him in go-karting, but... <laughs> I hate you. Um, and massive thank you to you guys, obviously. Like you're the whole, you're like the main, you, everyone watching is the reason why I've been able to go on this trip. So I owe it all to you guys. But yeah, now it's time to sleep and going home tomorrow. Back to reality, back to uni, back to the grind. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. But yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. You have anything to say, Aiden? Um, get out of my house. Out, out Bye. Make me feel like I've been stuck here head tight. She got me no one.